It's called the Restore by Rewalk, um, and it's intended for patients after they've had a stroke, so with lower limb disability on one side. We think that there's a broad application both for people who have recently had their stroke and also for those who are further down the line and maybe had their stroke several years ago but are still not happy with where they're at sort of with their walking quality. The bread and butter of the unit is what we call assist mode. Um, it doesn't look a ton different just right now once I've switched into it, but we'll have Chris go ahead and start taking some steps, do a few laps around the room here, and if you keep your eye on those cables down below, um, you'll see that every time that his left toes are meant to be lifting up, the front cable is contracting, and every time that that heel is ready in a position where it should be pushing off to propel himself forward, the back cable will contract. We're finally at the point where we can get it to stroke patients. So we received our FDA clearance um, a few weeks back and we're now ready. We're hitting the ground running as fast as we can to try to get this out to as many people as possible. So here in the US and also over in Europe, we have clearance for, for sales to, to clinics. In the range of $30,000, so a little bit less than that. Um, and we have a few different programs where we can work with people for leasing options and things like that as well. So as compared to other robotics that are currently on the market, you know, a smaller clinic might think that that's, you know, robotics for gait training is not something that they could even dream of. This is definitely, we're hoping, going to change the game for that and get more than just the big institutions being able to do this revolutionary work with the stroke patients.